Chief Minion. The thing is, I want my Priest of Forgotten Gods back. Is this weird doing this? <laughs> Just to get the Priest of Forgotten Gods back. It probably is. <laughs> it probably is, but I want, want her back. So badly. Yep. So badly that I'll do this. Yeah. Yeah, it's going pretty well. There can never be enough blood sacrifice. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but then scared the neighbors with that laugh. Probably scared them already, but <laughs> even more so. So what is this deck? This is about sacrifice. We have Mayhem Devil. Whenever you sacrifice a permanent, it deals one damage to any target. We have Priest of the Forgotten Gods. You can sacrifice two other creatures and any number of target plays. Each lose two life and sacrifice a creature. You add two black and draw a card, which is, of course, amazing if you can get this off. The problem with Priest of the Forgotten Gods is that uh, two toughness that is in there. So she usually just instantly dies. But if she sticks on the board and if you manage to land a Chandra following her up, it's absolutely redonkously amazing. Uh, you can create two red 1-1 one -one elementals, and at the end of the turn you need to sacrifice them, but you can also eat them up with Priest of Forgotten Gods to trigger her to get that extra card, them sacrificing a creature, you adding two black mana and drawing card, which is of course amazing to be able to play the Cavalier of Night and Liliana Dread of the General, which are also centered around the sacrifice, as it so happens. When Cavalier of Night ends the battlefield, you may sacrifice another creature, uh, and when he dies, you return something with three or less. So you can return your Mayhem Devils, your Fabellapotop, and your Priest of Forgotten Gods. So as long as... You, you will keep this recursion going again and again and again. It's the same thing with Blood for Bones. As additional cost to cost a spell, sacrifice a creature. Also, of course, triggers the Mayhem Devil. And then you can kind of return the Cavalier of Knights. Like, when you get to the late game, you're just gonna be playing Cavalier of Knights like every goddamn turn. Because you get them back with Blood for Bones. Uh, and the Cavalier of Knights keep returning Priest of Forgotten Gods. And everything is just blood sacrifice. I love it. And of course, you draw cards of Liliana, both of uh, the Chandra, two one ones there. And basically everything you sacrifice, because you sacrifice a lot. Then we need something to not die to Esper every time. So we have the Devil, and as it so happens, Chandra has a, another ability she can use from time to time. Uh, minus two, you may cast target instant or source card with covered monkeys three or less from the graveyard. Uh, and if it would... Uh, then be uh, put into the graveyard you exiled instead. So, if you have the devil in your deck, that's pretty perfect for Shauna because you get the maximum value. You get a very, very good card, which is essentially good against every deck right now. And you can get it back from your graveyard. And if you don't want to get the devil back, if you want something cheaper, then you can put down, uh, or you can use the callous dismissal, which is also very good because we don't have any way to deal with like enchantments and stuff like that. That is pretty much deck. Let's jump into the games, shall we? Perg! Oh my god! He plays every day at the same time as I do. He should play when I wake up, which is very late, by the way. And Perg always plays at the same time. He's the new gym from sales, this guy. Oh my god. Okay. I have to wake up. How does one wake up? I don't know. I don't know, to be fair. Uh, this is a fine man. I mean, the Lotus Field is a little bit weird, but... It's <laughs> Almost always weird when you have it in an opening, and you never want it in your opening hand, but you always want to draw it later. When you have the Mayhem Devil. Think about it. Think about that combo. <laughs> oh, adjust the camera. Well, I'm still a vampire, so... <laughs> Probably have to do some more adjustments if I want to look like... <laughs> I don't know, Instagram model or something. They probably don't use this vampire filter. <laughs> that I'm using. <laughs> I'm actually very sunburned, but I'm using a vampire filter to just <laughs> make me look this way. Of course, that's what I'm doing. So you're the manas, Perg. You don't play much, huh? Well... Well, to be fair, we can't play much either. Because... <laughs> yeah, we did not draw. Maybe. Maybe we did not draw the best of hands. <laughs> that Lotus! Sometimes coming back to bite you. I must admit. I think we have 26 lands. So it's like 24 plus 2 Lotuses. Store ever. Well, at least there's this. There's this thing right here. Need a uh, create no. two elemental hasters. Ooh, and I love this part so much. I love it! <laughs> we get to do this. Likewise, these two. Store up! Go away, buddy. And we please draw a lander. Nope. Nope! <laughs> okay. Nope. 
Damn it! Damn it. Come on, please land! But if we draw a land, could have uh, could have done the blood for bones. That wouldn't have done anything. Turn. Uh. But we can't play Matcher unless we draw land. If we draw land, and he doesn't kill the priest of Forgotten Gods, then we can play Liliana, which would be amazing, of course. Absolutely ridiculous. But will we though? Come on! <laughs> you have to be kidding me. You have to be kidding me. Yes. Uh, yeah, I know I could attack in first, but <laughs> I just want to draw my land. Also, I forgot about it. <laughs> also, I forgot about it. Are you kidding me? Well, we have a cavalier knight. Sure. Uh, decline that. <laughs> Discard a card. Um. Um. Take the Chandra. Nah, he might kill the Chandra. The hell do we double up? Oh, maybe. Ah, that could draw us a card. <laughs> maybe that wasn't the best. And they should have played double up instead of Cavalier. We really need that land. 15 cards. One land in 15 cards? <laughs> or 16 cards? Whatever it was. 14 cards. Okay. That thing went away, huh? That thing went away. Well, I guess... I guess we put you out. Are we gonna win with one land? <laughs> Is that what's gonna happen? Kind of seems like it. Kind of seems like it right now. Wink. Yeah? Still Lotus Field. Yes, you, you, I know you can see it, but I want, I love complaining. I love it so much. Please allow me to complain some more. <laughs> mm. Mm. I think our Chandra's going away. I think. Oh, we can only kill creatures? Okay. Sure. Well, that's perfect. Why did I bring back this and not Fabulous Up? Man! <laughs> I am a man of many misplays. <laughs> I've seen trouble. Mm. Well. Well, well, well. All we can do uh, is to one once. I don't know if you've seen this before. Apparently, we didn't need more than <laughs> these two in, in uh, Comboners. Uh, okay, so we have two there, the three there, one up to tap, tapity taps, boom, boom, boom. I'll remember this. Use you, his face, the meat, sacrifice two, wing. And let's see, the drawer. Now we have lands now at least. Go for the mayhem devil. Maybe we do. <laughs> for blood for bones back the Cavalier Knight. Yeah, that could be good. Like twice you. Wink. Wink. And come on. Resolve. Blood for bones, please. We have a lot of cards. Go <laughs> on! All you need. Two cards. <laughs> one land. <laughs> one Chandra. And one one two sacrifice, dude. All you need, Mythic. I wonder how you rank up in Mythic. I was ranked 600 when I went to sleep, and I woke up as 800. <laughs> should I play in my sleep? <laughs> Wizards, should I play in my sleep? Yes, you should, they say. And also give us all your monies. <laughs> Buy the new uh, Battle Pass or whatever it's called. Soon it's gonna be. <laughs> if you want access to better RNG, check out our new Battle Pass. <laughs> Soon. soon, soon, soon. Priest of Forgotten Gods coming down. What will this guy be playing then? Elementals. Oh, or is it? Ah, it's the omniscience combo. I don't like that. Oh, that's perfect, buddy. Absolutely amazing. That I am enjoying. Ooh. And mobile phone a little bit close <laughs> to the recording device. 
They are so cute. Man, this combo is good, by the way. <laughs> if they don't kill Priest of God, I don't know why so sometimes people don't kill this immediately. This is way too dangerous to have on the board. Way too dangerous. Ink. Maybe I need more lands in this deck. Maybe. We'll see, though. Dread. Oh my god! All these guys we've faced before. <laughs> They always play at the same time as me. That's the thing. Japanese time zone. Yep. Didn't like that guy. Do we have a basic? I don't know. No, we don't. <laughs> God damn. Oh, now he knows. <laughs> now he knows we don't have a basic. Uh, okay. Sure. Uh, we'll blood for bones that back though. Wait, these two red one ones. Go in and smack him. These little guys are great. Blood for bones. You there. Bring back our forgotten gods. We need him. Or her. And then let's see. Do you have another? Assassin's Trophy? Well, I don't have basics. So <laughs> you probably figured that out by now. Checks this out. Ah, that's a pretty, pretty sweet card. Got him! Got him, got him, got him. Got him, got him, got him! I put in a swamp and an island in the deck. I think that might be good. <laughs> if we're up against more of that. More of that stuff. Okay, here we go. Do four lands. Well. Four lands is usually better than uh, no lands. Usually. Unless you're Baos. Yes, MTG. Yes. Yes. We gotta play. Play magics. Okay, Temple of Silence. Huh? Looks like Commander Dreadlord. Mad Dreadhorde. Hmm. I think I pay this life. Reason being, if I draw another red source, I might want to play Chandra. Wink. Ooh, are we gonna see this combo right here? This is so good if you get this going. Not easy to get going, but if you do, Glow Spur Shaman. Yeah, it has to be Commander Dreadhorde. Yep, there's a Kethis there. There's a Kethis! But he might not play it, though. He could also reanimate it. Hmm. Could be some special type of deck. The special deck. Yes. Could be the special deck. Uh, no attacks here. No. Sean up his Mayhem Devil. Also a little bit schmexy, must be. Must say it's a little bit schmexy. Okay. Soren. Vengeful Bloodlord. Returns, Kethis! Ah, that's pretty good. Good stuff. Yep. Ooh. Well. Well, well, well. What we can do here. Katis can play Oath of Kaya from the graveyard, but that's about it. We could bedevil it. Could bedevil the Katis. Wink. And go in for Mr. Soren. Doesn't have a good blocker in close for each other. I mean, I guess it's decent, but... But, but not that good. Not that good, I say. Soren then, he's one damage to us. And he puts down another Glorious Spur. Close for Shaman. Okay. Well, this time we have Chandra... Chandra Dooge. Which can go in with. Chandra dudes and a Calisys missile or something. I don't know exactly. Paradise Druid. Ooh, everything has one nozzle. So let's see here. We go in with two dudes. He has to sacrifice both of them. Which is pretty sweet. And if it doesn't, they deal a lot of damage. So. Yeah, let's do this. And then we go in. Wink. Wink. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. It's working out. I'm liking this. Glowspore Shaman gets in front. Para Paradisia Druid, though. You don't block her. The <laughs> sword's gonna fall. Oh, no, it's not. Ah, it's not. Um, do this miss something? Ah, what would that be? I don't know. Yep. 
So we deal one damage to any target that we saw in them. Zorin. I'm familiar with pain. Yes, MTG. There is some interesting deck that is playing. Some sort of combo owners. Yep. Chandra getting beaten down here. But now we're gonna get Liliana plus Chandra on the board. That's amazing. Honestly amazing. What's he gonna play though? What you, what you, what you gonna play? Commander Dreador. Nah, don't have. You have five manas. A lot of glow spur shamans. Okay. Ah, his own. Loyal and silent. Well, I guess we have to kill that Liliana then. It's about the only way here. Yeah, that's pretty good. We kill the Liliana. We bounce the token. <laughs> we kill the sword. That's pretty. That's pretty good. That's pretty good, I say. And we go in. Kill off Soren. Badank. And put this into play. Tapped. And what do you do? Right to red one. Oh, I could have done that earlier. I put a loyalty counter. A loyalty counter on there. Need some loyalty. Do you now command red lord? You might. You might do that. Would be <laughs> a little bit problematic for us. Ah, well, we can bedevil. It's pretty good to have Shauna with minus two for bedevil. Pretty noise. Okay. The Elder Spell. Sure. Sure, 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 sure. Well. How many Elder Spells might he have? Oh. Impossible to know. Impossible to know. We're going in there. Or that face. <laughs> Rush! <laughs> I love that people in Mythic very often main deck two, three, four Elder spells because there's so much Esper control here. This is like a mainstay in like every deck now. <laughs> I know everyone just hated on me when I put Elder spell in my earlier decks. Now it seems like the Mythic people do it. <laughs> too much Espers. Too much Esper makes you do weird things. Uh, okay. There was blood sacrifice going on there. <laughs> this guy... You guys are bloodhound for blood sacrifice. <laughs> Is that blood sacrifice? Is that blood sacrifice? Huh? Was it? Well, it was. Oh, then! God damn you, I get you. <laughs> uh, oh, this Cavalier Knight, pretty good. Pretty good, I say. Sacrifice that token. Kill off. Big Papa Bood. Dude. <laughs> okay, kill you. Oh, did I also deal damage to you? That's not what I, really what I meant, but sure. But show. Uh, we'll just go in there. Smack a dank him. Smack a dank him. Smack a dankers. Um, let's see here. Anything we want to return here? Nah, no, not really. Go for another. Le Dude on the board then. And tapped. He could have another Elder spell. Easily get rid of the Lilianas. Would love to get some value out of these boys. These boys. I mean, we're kind of killing them also. <laughs> we're also winning the game, but... But I were more about Liliana than winning the game. <laughs> to be fair. It's more important to keep her alive than winning. But I, I'd do anything for you, Liliana. How beautiful. Beautiful woman. Give me a pedestal and I'll put you on it. Definitely. I'll treat you with white knight respect. I'll defend you. Both in speech and with my sword. I have a sword. Okay. I will draw a card. Oath of Kaya. Legion's end. Oh, we're gonna see my hand, huh? Legion's End, wow. That's that's a spicy thing you got going there. Right there. Um Well, if we attack in, we can get back the Mayhem Devil. And draw cards. That'd be pretty cool. Go in. And also prevent him from having six mana. I know this is a little bit weird. 
little bit weird. Not <laughs> I do this, but... But I think this is fine. Now we get back to Mayhem Devil. Wink, wink. And we draw a lot of cards. Mm. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe it wasn't the best. And we have the same power on the board. Thanks to Priest of Forgotten Gods. I don't know. I don't know. Could have ultimated easier, I guess. Didn't. Got him anyways, though. Got him! Got him, got him, got him, got him. Gahka! Man, I've played all these people before. I know them. I know them. They're my buddies. My friends. My friendly friends. Call all my friends my friendly friends. And all my friends like it. <laughs> they say anything. <laughs> now, spread some bad rumors about them. In my mansion. Okay, Lon Wells. Uh. Uh. I think Watery Grave. We might want to go for a Devil for some reason. Then it would be more ideal to lead him. Ah, it doesn't matter. I'm thinking way too much. I'm reaching no conclusions. <laughs> Man, this guy's laughter. <laughs> Domri! I gotta get a headache whenever I'm up against Domri. I'm like, oh, this guy is trying too much. Domri is just trying too much. Just get a lady and settle down. <laughs> this guy is out, out in the bars. <laughs> out in the bars and it's not really working out for him. That's what I think. Rule Spellbreaker. And some damage. Uh, we'll say no boxing. Uh, yeah. Two lands, 14 HP. I will, I mean, I've, been, I've been quite a lot lower, to be fair. To be fair, uh, would be amazing to put down a uh, Priest of Forgotten God, sir. Take six plus. Uh, we might die, but we'll, we'll try. We'll try. I think this is the play which might also. Hmm. Ah, no thanks. This might also win us the game. If he doesn't, if this goes uncontested, if it goes maybe in with Lonrel for some reason, pushing for more damage. Okay. Is this the uh, Ilharg? Gruul Spellbreaker. This is like the only good Gruul card <laughs> that makes Gruul so much better, honestly. <laughs> I know a lot of people like other cards in Ghoul, but I think this is like the only good card in my opinion. Ghoul. But when they draw multiples of it, man, it's good. Yeah, I could have maybe foreseen that it would. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Maybe. Uh, well, we have no way out of this. We have no board clears in this deck. We only have a single target removal. Uh, so this is. Yeah, this is over. Who touched my meat? Let's see here. Hopefully. Uh, it's a decent hand. Liliana there looking not so good, but sure, keep. Three lands, that's amazing. <laughs> that's honestly amazing. I've had a period of uh, extreme mana skewage. I think it follows if you if you won a lot. Uh, the, the, I don't know. The algorithm wants to compensate and make you lose a lot. <laughs> the easiest way is, of course, give you shit lands. Easiest way to I draw too many lands or draw no lands at all. Easy way to regulate wins. Mm. <laughs> Do you really believe in the lizard snakes? Well, I don't know. I don't know. Sometimes their existence just makes me believe in them. Their mere existence. Um. Oh, well, you you made a mistake in that mayhem level. Tapped. Hope you don't have another boat erasure. They always have two though. <laughs> So I guess this Chandra will go. I guess this Chandra. How to go. Well, at least we have the Lilianas. And we get to that point. Or do you have your third? Sometimes they have three. They always have two. But sometimes they even have three. Uh, Yeah, sure. Can we draw land now? Yes. Thank you. 
Now we might lose our last Liliana if she has, he has another Bolas. Yes, indeed he had. He had it all! Well, that's very good for us to build that. Wink. Ooh, another Cavalier of Night. Um, I will go in. Go in with you. Go in with you, I say. Then we could sacrifice these two to kill this bolus. And play the other Cavalier of Night. Yeah, sure. Draws us some more cards also. You there, mister. Wink, wink. Submit this. Return something. Return the... Yeah, I think it's double up. I'm gonna sacrifice him anyways. Where are we? Maybe you're not gonna do that. Ooh, a blood for bones. Blood for bones. Nah, we're just gonna play this without target. Uh, decline. And then turn. End of the turn! And then we can just blood for bones. The Cavalier of Night into another Cavalier of Night. If you want to. Uh, the Carnarium. Sure. Doesn't deal with the Cavalier, buddy. Doesn't deal with the Cavalier. Okay, another cry. Sure. Well, go in with Cavalier Knight. Mm hmm. And uh, Blood for Bones. Sacrifice this creature. Yes! Uh, okay, so the Mayhem Devil comes back. And the Cavalier Knight comes back. And we get the Cavalier Knight to our hand. Do I want sacrifice? No, no. I'm fine. And do we keep one land in hand in case he has some double discard? Yeah, that's probably the only thing that can get us now. Double discard into double removal or something. Something like that. Who touched my meat? Well, that's Cry the Canarium looking miserable there. Body, 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 body. Body, 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 body. And Cavalier Knight. Man, I love this card so much. Decline. It's so good, it just... If they kill it, you get the juicy part- You get some other juicy cards back, so... It doesn't matter if they kill it. And he kills other stuff. Got it. Sneaked! <laughs> Almost like one of the, the members. Check out the join button, by the way. Uh... I remember all the, <laughs> all the names, by the way. Almost by heart. It's like Luria Stars, Sneak. <laughs> all is in, in the same order. Um, need blue. But our opponent goes first. We might draw into it. I think we'll keep it. I think we'll keep this. I mean, the other cards are pretty great, to be fair. The great cards. Is it Sneak gonna play them? But it would be so nice if this was something that produced blue. Blue Manish. Please. It's gonna be mono red. Mm. Okay, Grulians. I'm much more a fan of playing against Grulians. Uh, okay, well, I have nothing. <laughs> so, <laughs> I just play the Dragon Skull Summit and pass like a dingus. The Kindling Phoenix. Hmm. Well, if I'd had a blue manish, I'd had a blue manish. What we can do, though. Long-term plan, but we could put down Mayhem Devil. <laughs> then we could... Ah, uh, it's gonna be difficult. We're gonna end of turn Bedevil this. The next turn, play Chandra. These two things which we sacrifice kill off the, to uh, the totem with. <laughs> it's a very long-term strategy, but might just work. Might just work. <laughs> mm hmm. There's a sulfur fault. That's pretty nice. Pretty nice, I say. Uh, well, we pass them. Pass kill, kill the rekindling. When he goes in. He surely does. 
could also balance this token. Not the way of doing it. But these guys are much better, I think. Paradiso Druid, though. And it goes in. Inling. Yes, we will kill that Phoenix. And then... Place something. Cavalier of Thorns. Okay, top five cards and put a land card. Okay. Sure, 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 sure. Sure, 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 sure. And a Lawn Wealth. Well? Well, well, well. Let's see here. Pay the two life. Play the Chandra, Acolyte of Flame. Create these two red 1-1s. One then we're gonna shoot this thing and a Paradise Druid. And then we're gonna have a Fubulup to block with, I think. That's pretty good. Fubulup a thup. Ooh, that's Cavalier Knight. Uh, no attack, sir. And then we kill this guy. And we kill this Paradise Druid. And that's pretty decent, honestly. Now we have a blocker for Cavalier with Thorns. And it kind of has to go in for Chandra. Might burn the Mayhem Devil, I guess. Might. Scorgon Elkite! That's a good one. Kills off our Chandra. Surely. Surely. Wow. Cavalier Thorns not coming in. Do we block that guy? Do we just take five? Hmm. I think we say no blocks for the time being. You might want to Cavalier of Night kill the Skargan Elkite there. With the Fubbleptops. Wink! Sacrifice the Fubbleptop. Kill the Skargan Elkite. Oh, one damage, huh? And you kill this. Twink. Twink. Slowly shooting them down here. Uh, no attacks. Gonna take five more from Cavalier of Thorns though. Uh, unless we block with the Mayhem Devil, I guess. A little bit dangerous going down that low. Oh, don't say. Well, it could push for damage, but we have Life Link on our Cavalier of Knight, so that's pretty sweet. Oh, you have a red burn spell you want to use. On our Mayhem Devil. And then only going with Cavalier Knight. I think that's what it's going to do. Okay. Well, if that is what it does... I think I say no blocks. I don't think it's going to burn four for one red mana. I don't think so. Um, and then let's see here. Would be pretty sweet... Bounce, what is this? Non-land permanent. Can't bounce. And bounce the Cavalier of Thorns. Can we somehow get to Nissa? Uh, we can Chandra. Dear. Love in the bin. We can Chandra the Devil. The Nissa. Uh, that's not amazing. Probably bounce is better. Bounce the Nissa. Uh, then go in with the, let's see here. Cavalier of Night. We need that life gain. Get that life gain on. And see what it does. Okay, just takes it. And then, let's see here. We could do some, uh, some sacrifice. Hmm. Why did I do this? I should have just played Chandra, <laughs> killed from the graveyard. Nah, now we have a blocker. That's pretty good. I put a loyalty on this, and that should be pretty good, unless he has a removal. If I do two pings, that won't, pr that won't change anything anyways. So just do this loyalty. Add some loyalty. Mm. It's gonna come in with everything for Chandra. We can block... We can block a mountain, we can block the Cavalier of Night. 
Oh, he's gonna have a mountain and a paradise druid, though. I will see. We will see. Ooh, a Phenoxa. Change of plans. Interesting. Goes in for Chandra. 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 Only those two? Only those. Oh. Well, one. I'm not afraid of taking one hit here, so. Yeah. One can die. Well, that's rude. Ooh. Ooh. Let's see here. Can we? Hmm. We can Cavalier of Night. Yeah, we can kill the Rekindling Phoenix easily with the two red one, one ones. And then Cavalier of Night. Sacrifice you. We'll deal one damage to something. Uh, deal to this. And then kill this guy. Kill this guy, I say. Did one damage to that. That's good. And let's see here. Do we go in with this guy also? Uh, do we have anything in the bin? Yeah, we have probably left up in the bin. So, sure. Go in with you. Gain some more life. Let's see if it blocks. It blocks. It double blocks! Yep. Once you get rid of it. Sure. That's perfect. Then we get a Fibbulopth. Draw another card. Card. Ooh. An end of turn. We'll deal one damage to that totem. Ooh! Beautiful! <laughs> Beautiful! Man, I love this deck. There's so many interactions and there's so many ways for me to mess this up also. <laughs> no! That's another one. I have so many, buddy. So many. Um, well, this time, let's see here. We can just blood for bones. We can just do this. We can create two red 1-1 one, one hasters. We can blood for bones. The Fibbalopathop. Deal one damage to, sure, this guy. Return the Cavalier of Night. And Fibbalopathop. Uh, let's see here. Sacrifice this guy. Sure. Kill this guy. Now he's down to four. Um, so now we can... Let's see. We can Callus Dismissal the... Now we can just go in with the Cavalier of Night. We have nothing in the graveyard though. If he blocks. <laughs> that's a little bit bad. But that's fine. That's fine, I think. Uh, yeah, going with this guy. If it blocks. Yes, he blocks. Fortunately, we don't have anything in the graveyard, but at least this guy dies. Oh, what's he return? Rekindling Phoenix? Yep. Rekindling Phoenix again now. Cool. And... Maybe I shouldn't have attacked in there. I think about it. Or maybe it's fine. Kill this. 16 16, but we have much, much, much better board. Oh, much better board. Okay, we can do the same thing for the third time. Thank <laughs> <Like my> you. <laughs> He's had enough of this! He's seen enough! <laughs> We didn't even get the Liliana. Okay. Perfect. Keep this. Perfect. Tapped. Tappity tapped. Um. Yeah, that's a fine hand, I think. We have Chandra. Not Mono Red. You get matched so much against Mono Red when you play Grixis. Because it's such a bad matchup for you. I hate it. Because if you play Esper. You're not gonna see Monoret a single time. <laughs> That's the unfortunate part. Sure. At least I don't when I play Esper. Let me know in the comments if you see Esper 
It would be interesting to see if, if it's just me who has that experience. Whenever I have a lot of life gain in my deck, I never, ever, ever get matched against Monorath. And they surely have something in their system which figures that out. Like, okay, he has a lot of life gain. Maybe I shouldn't match him against Monorath because they will cry a million tears and they will have a bad experience. I think that would work. I'm not sure. Also, I love conspiracy theories and I believe in lizard snakes. <laughs> so, so it might, I might not be the, why, the guy you should trust on this. Just saying. <laughs> there might be other people better suited for trusting. Uh, this is not Mono Red, so I was completely lying. And let's see here. Yes, two red one ones. And go in and smack him. Well, this is pretty good. Pretty good start. When I'm done complaining, get <laughs> a pretty good start. I just think the Priest of Forgotten Gods has about 0% chance of surviving here, but that's fine. We can uh, Cavalier of Night here, so. Uh, I'm not too too concerned. Are you data? Are you data? Mm. That's here. Wait, those two. Two one ones. And yes. You there, mister. You will have to take some punishment. Wink. Sacrifice the Drew Killing Phoenix. Sacrifice him, I say. Sure. And then he gets a little them. And then we just. Shabadunk. Oh, I should have gone in first, I guess. Before I did this. Ah! They got in for Tybalt. Well, I don't have any life gains. So it doesn't matter too much if he stays around, to be fair. I'm not gonna gain any life, anyways. And yeah, IO data. What you gonna do, brother? Brother from another mother. I think you're a little bit in trouble there. We have a coming down also. Seal the deal there. Seal that deal. A lot of people started liking Rekindling Phoenix. I don't like him right now in the current meta game. I, will, I guess he's good against Mono Red. Or decent against Mono Red. Because they need two burn spells. Oh. What is that? Don't target creature card. Don't target planeswalk card. And then... Then he shocks it! I don't like that, he says. Sure. You don't have to like it. Just have to endure it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, why didn't you create dudes before you went in? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. That was, one could say, a mistake. Oh, yeah, this guy. This guy, huh? Mm, I think we'll do this. We'll do... Uh, uh, uh. Excellent minion. The thing is, I want my Priest of Forgotten Gods back. Is this weird, doing this? <laughs> Just to get the Priest of Forgotten Gods back? It probably is. <laughs> it probably is, but I want, want her back. So badly. Yep. So badly that I'll do this. Yeah. Yeah, let's go pretty well. I feel a little bit bad for IO data. Also, I feel a little bit bad about me complaining the entire first half of this game. But I like complaining. I love it. Makes me feel better about myself. My ego just gets a boot. Yes, it's everyone else's fault. It's not your fault, Dark Lord. Yes, you're doing everything perfect. It's everyone else. Yes. So I robbed myself. We can leave Phoenix coming down again. What a guy, huh? Guy. What a guy. What a girl. What a feeling. Da -da 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 -da. Yeah, you there. You lose your Phoenix. Yeah. And we draw two cards. Wow, we have a lot of cards. We have so many cards. Sure. I'll get your little totem there. Man, we have too many cards. Good mindless minions. Okay. <laughs> yeah, we will draw. Oh, my freaking god. <laughs> okay. Yeah, this deck is sane and all. <laughs> it's not completely broken. 
When you get this off, when you get Liliana with Chandra. Oh my god. This is glorious. Poor IO data. He did not. Did not want this to have happen. Smacks everyone. And then. Kills Priest of Gothic Gods. Smacks him down. Well, draw another card. I have to be careful not to mill ourselves. <laughs> okay. Hmm. Mm -mm -mm. Well, we just bedevil the massacre girl, you say. Yes. Yes, we could do that. Sure. Bedevil you. Go in. My god. <laughs> oh my god. Look at all those creatures. I think we'll kill this guy off. <laughs> Finally. Face. Boom, boom, boom. Mayhem Devil. And what else? Double up, double up. Can't we kill him this turn? I think we can. I think we honestly can. No, we can't sacrifice two things. Ah! Almost. Almost. Got him! 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 Purge okay. again! <laughs> We're back! We're back where we started! My god! The 360. Magic. A magical 360. Around the universe. There's a purge and dropping down that swamp. Boomp. Purg. Not purge. Purg. Purg. Like a pirogi. What's that even called in English? It's a pirogi? Pirog? I have no. I have no. The priest of the golden gods coming down here. Ooh, coming down. Coming downtown. Checking out the view. I mean, that reaps up. That's a little bit dangerous. Okay. Slightly dangerous. Well. 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 I will take a lot of punishment then. This. And yes. With you. You there, mister. You need to sacrifice. Well, you can sacrifice Dreadnought, but you kill our priest of Forgotten Gods. Which, and draw a card, which is probably pretty good for you. What do we do with all this? Huh? Not a problem. Sure. Sure. It's not like I have a trick here up my sleeve. Sure. Draw a card also. It's not like I have another one! <laughs> got him. Kind of. <laughs> kind of got him. He kind of got me also. Like a double got him. Got our got the everything. Oh my god, okay. What a pickle, huh? Well, we have another Chandra. We have another Chandra, so that Chandra die, I guess. Training is so hard. Training is so hard. Mm. Let's see here. Can't play anything extra. Now maybe we can. Maybe we can play the Mayhem Devil. Yeah? If you tap correctly and we have one red mana over, if you tap like this. Ooh, then we can play the Mayhem Devil also. And then we go two elementals. Eat them up. You there, mister. You there, mister. Two creatures. And he'll just draw a card there, surely. Nope. That guy died, okay. One damage to any target. And that damage fell on that girl, sure. I'm telling the abbot. I'm telling them. Sure. Mayhem devil. Mayhem devil. Down on the board. Down and blocking. Hmm. <laughs> I didn't even realize we have three Lilial in them. Gonna need them. So we're gonna need them. Gonna be crucial for our victory here. Actually, it might be super good next turn to go uh, Priest of Forgotten Gods. Oh, activate Chandra. Activate Priest of Forgotten Gods. Go Liliana. Go Ham. Then Probably done with this game, I think. Get that off. And if he stops it, we have another Liliana. A knightly Evan Leaden. He's putting down the artillery here. Sure. 
I mean, it would be an amazing to have her alive, but I'd rather kill off that dude. Draw a card and deal one damage. Any target. Any target! Well, that's, rude. that's rude. I agree. Very rude. Very, very rude. Mm. Well, great. Two 1-1 one, one hasters. I don't have much of interest there. Get some black manas. Submit. Sacrifice two creatures. Boink. Blood sacrifice needed there. Okay. This is one damage. Yeah, he doesn't like that girl. That's Fao Shao. Lil Yana. Do we eat up the Judith Scourge? Diva. And our Priest of Forgotten Gods. Yeah, I think we do. We do. Noise. And, I mean, she will kill our Chandra, but she would have died anyway, so it doesn't matter. I will probably find out the Chandra. Wink. Wink. I just love doing the minus with Chandra. Or with Liliana. You might have a Haster or a Burn spell or something, but I will just play another Liliana. And then another Liliana. And then another Liliana. Ooh. Okay, okay. So, zombie. Let's like see here. Return a priest of forgotten gods. And bounce? No, we don't have enough mana. Or we draw into it. That's a little bit risky. A little bit risky. Maybe just do this and Callus's missile to spawn me. Wink. I think we got him. I think we got him! Think we got you, Purge! <laughs> back where we started. Got back there and back again. Oh my god, <laughs> do we really... Do we really add insult to injury here? Sure. Sure. Oh, they're so cute. Well... Well, I can safely go in with... Like everyone. Except the Mayhem Devil. Everyone except the Mayhem Devil. Yeah, you're going down, buddy. Or you're going downtown. Ooh, that's a nice part to have there. Well, these guys are gonna die and they're gonna kill the, uh, the spawn Mayhem anyway, so. Wink, wink. And I'm gonna draw some cards. Wink. Mayhem Devil. A little bit silly at this point. Love that I have to spare Liliana, should something go awry <laughs> in this matchup. Skargan Alkite, though. I didn't think I had a, a devil prepared. Oh, he's gonna be so sad when he goes in for Liliana. Or Chandra. Which one is it? It's Chandra. Uh, no, 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 well, we got there and back again. <laughs> Member shout out. Member shout out. Thank you everyone so much for watching. And a special thank you, of course, to our dear members. Simon Lauer, Master Bagging Gaming, Magic Pistol Man, Alan Clark, Steinerk Bakken, Ramen Noodles for Me, Adam Alexis, Own77, Blue Dragon, Rodney Cox, MTG Noob, Herman M, Agri Reborn, The Soft Pillow, Snick Luria, Stars, Michael Aguilar, Shamanix, Spencer Hofstie, Carlos Martinez, Alex Michael, Nathaniel Nissard, Laser Set to Stun, Jeff Henry, Eric0234, Diesel Fizzlepop, Ellie Curtis, Strange Brondheis, Leanin, into it, Cyberjunk Punk, Santa John, Bradley Williams, Michael W, Pocky U, Matthias Porley, Top Let's Investments, Kronos 1107, Wokie Floren, W Lutz 1978. You guys are amazing. If you also want to become a Dark Disciple, rule the underworld, and all that jazz, then check out the join button next to the subscribe button. Thanks so much for watching, and see you next time.